what is up YouTube? We're back with another video, this time another collaboration. If you watched last week, I did the OVO Jurassic Park, but this time OVO and Roots collabing for another year. I feel like there's a yearly tradition at this point. But anyways, I ended up uh, copying the hoodie on that Friday of the release, uh, just the black hoodie and that regular nice design that they did. And uh, yeah, I'll show you a little bit about it right now. Um, so pretty much when it comes to like sizing for this sort of stuff, you know, uh, like just, it's the same pretty much for Roots and OVO. Like it's, uh, Roots makes these I believe, but OVO sells them. The sizing is pretty much standard across OVO, in my opinion, or a Roots hoodie. It's exactly the same as whatever you would order. It's just that normal standard fit, so. So this hoodie is really cool they did this year, the design. Uh, it's kind of similar to like past years, but it's got like the Roots uh, in like yellow and white outline. It's got the OVO Owl in that white and like I believe black. It's got October's very own and Canada and that spaced out lettering which is really nice. What I think is a really cool detail about this is like the drawstrings, they're like on the, it's like literally on the hood. Like it's not even on like the actual sweater. Uh, it's like on the, it's like in the hood and it's kind of like inside here and stuff and you can bring it out and then very, very thick drawstrings which is really nice. It's got roots uh, in the same outline on the sweater and the same outline with the green though on the OG Owl and it's got XL obviously made in Canada and then on the back it's got October's very own nothing on the back as you can see very simple hoodie like very nice definitely recommend it obviously it's got that roots quality and stuff where you know it is really good I think they price this at 168 or 158 um, so pretty good pricing OVO has been slowly raising their prices and stuff which is kind of annoying but you know what happens I guess the more you continue but this year's collab was pretty good. They had uh, these, actually these Nordic boots, which are pretty cool that Roots always uh, comes up with with these red laces and stuff, which I thought was really cool. I thought that was gonna be priced really bad. It wasn't too bad, it was like 250 bucks. Um, a lot, some stuff is still available on the site, so you can go check that out as well. But um, yeah, like they had, they had different colors for all the hoodies, crew necks, uh, sweats were really nice as well. Because um, we thought it was gonna happen in October, but I guess it wasn't gonna happen, so by them doing it in November. Um, now, I feel like it's definitely gonna be a yearly tradition. It's never stopping, so. But before we leave here today, I want to show you the tags, because the tags are always amazing. So this year they put red on it, so they have like the same kind of design we were talking about before, uh, but it's red in the background, October's very own 2021. And then uh, it's got Roots as a trademark of Roots Corporation. And on the back, it's got the same kind of thing, just with the barcode. Uh, XL black hoodie and stuff, which is really nice as well. The outline of the white is really nice as well. And it does say this garment has been dyed using a special process to achieve the color. It can transfer to other garments, so like avoid the contact with light colored surfaces so you can wash separately. So as you can see that green was like their flagship uh, color of last year, as you can see. So yeah, really cool. And they had a lot of this design obviously with the beaver, but this time it was more on the OG Owl and the, and the Roots, right? So, which was nice, which was nice as well, obviously. But, um, but yeah, guys, let me know if you ended up checking out this collection. Do you think it was good? Do you think they're oversaturated at this point? Obviously, it's been at least like six, seven years, um, like of this year that has happened every single year. And did you cop anything from the collection? Were you trying to? Obviously, I think it was on Black Friday it released. So obviously, a lot of spending money around, a lot of businesses making money and stuff. And if you were able to fit it into your budget. Uh, you know, it was definitely, definitely something good to have. But, um, and rate my pickups if you think the hoodie was a good pickup at all. And, uh, and yeah, guys. But anyways, guys, thank you for making it to this part of the video. If you'd even consider leaving a like, commenting, subscribing, and turn that post notification bell as well. It helps us a ton here at the channel with the engagement and stuff. So, um, yeah, keep helping us grow and we can continue on the road to monetization. So, but anyways, guys, appreciate you for tuning in. That was my review of the OVO Roots collaboration 2021 with my black hoodie. Peace.